hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new to my channel welcome my name is b Dumela and welcome to my channel please do hit that subscribe button because i'd love to have you part of my family and community and if you are returning welcome and thank you for always coming back and choosing me um so guys as you can tell by the title of this video we are doing a hair care video <laughs> oh my god so guys this is a video of how i washed my hair and how i just plated it yeah my hair was due for a wash as i've said in the previous vlog but i couldn't go to the salon so i just decided to do my hair at home so if this sounds like something that you might be interested in please do keep on watching and enjoy the video please remember to like comment and share with friends and don't forget to subscribe uh, please <laughs> enjoy <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to my first hair care video. Please don't mind my voice, I've got the flu and I know I sound like a man. <laughs> so this is how my hair is looking, or was looking. I have neglected my hair and I am not proud child, hell no. So the first thing that I do is wet my hair. What I've learned from my um, hair care um, girlies is that you do not touch dry hair. You do not work on dry hair because yeah natural hair is a really 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 painful so i just start off by just wetting my hair so that i can easily work with it as you can see this hair oh my gosh <laughs> it needs a lot of repair because i have neglected it for so long <laughs> So what I try to do is just pull my hair and then spray the water so that the water can also like touch my scalp because my hair is really um really dry and the products like just take time to absorb into my hair so it gets a lot easier when I just pull it and spray the water. So I will be using this hydrating and softening shampoo from Every True, which I got from Clicks. The shampoo is sulfate free and paraben free and it also says it is mineral oil free. So usually what I would do is just wet my hair in the bathroom and just pour just the shampoo on my head. But for the purpose of this video, I'll be working in sections. As you can see, I'm starting off with the front so that I shampoo my whole head so it's better to work the hair into sections. It's much easier that way. Then I just use like these hair clips to just hold my hair to see um, which hair I have worked on so that I don't shampoo the same um, place twice. So this shampoo claims to be infused with shea butter and coconut oil to lock in moisture. It claims to stimulate hair growth and reduce knots dryness and hair breakage and i feel i feel like that's what my hair needs 
right now. I don't know if you guys can see from my hands, but my hair is really breaking out a lot. So hopefully the shampoo will help with that. And guys, but home, I am doing a voiceover, it's so tiring. I am never doing a video and not talking because what in the hell? <laughs> so here I'm just putting more water so that I can put more shampoo. And yeah, I'll just finish um washing the hair off in the bathroom and now i'll just be giving myself a head massage which is really important So because I do not have a cotton towel, I'll be using my t-shirt. Um, apparently using a cotton towel um, helps absorb black water without causing your hair any breakage or frizz. So right now, I will just be deep conditioning my hair with this deep conditioner. The last time I used the the hair protein treatment and i loved it but this time i thought i should just use this um deep conditioner i love 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 the texture of this deep conditioner guys you guys and i'm sorry i keep like running out of breath <laughs> probably i don't know how i'm sounding like but yeah each job each job hey so i'll also be working in sections here and just clipping my hair with this hair clip so that i do not put conditioner twice like on the same part and then i will just be detangling my hair with this afro comb because i couldn't find the other like a wide um tooth comb but this also worked fine so yeah after applying the conditioner i just use this afro comb to detangle and it is always better to start um at the bottom and working your way up while um detangling hey guys and i'm really sorry about the background noise like the taxis and that funny funny sound <laughs> there's nothing i can do really so as i've mentioned never work on dry hair so i start off by wetting my hair with this hairspray and then applying the conditioner so that i can work on my hair damp This is how my hair is looking after applying the 
that the deep conditioner i really 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 love it it is detangled as you can see as i work work my fingers through my hair um yeah i really 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 love the results but my hair is still breaking a lot child Yeah, and so because I couldn't find like wrap, paper wrap, plastic wrap, man, I just used um, any plastic that I found and just tied my hair with a satin duke and just gonna wait for 20 minutes before rinsing off this um, deep conditioner. And I come back with clean, 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 clean hair. So I will be sectioning my hair and I'm just going to use um, these um, bands I made for myself from my stockings. And I found my white, um, white tooth comb. <laughs> and I believe I'm about to do the LCO method now the liquid or leave-in conditioner cream and oil um and i've heard from i was watching this other hair hair care enthusiast um video she said you can also opt for shea butter so i will be using shea butter instead of a cream yeah i hope that makes sense For my liquid, I will be using my water bottle. And as I've, as I've said, that I'm working in sections, and here's the sheer butter that I'll be using from Masori. Most of these products are from Masori, it's only the shampoo that is from Clix. Yo, guys, but look at how clean this hair looks. What in the hell? Uh -uh. So, I'm starting off with the water and then following up with this shea butter. I'm not going to take a lot. I'm just going to take um, just a little, rub it in my hands and then just apply it on my hair. And then I'm just detangling my hair with this white comb again just to make sure that my hair isn't in knots yeah and then for the oil guys i'm going to be using this um i'm going to be using the all in one oil also from my sweaty so what i love about this oil is that it's not like too thick like other oils that i've used actually i've only used was it just one hair oil and it was like really 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 um thick so what i like look at this hair though <gasps> what 
I love it. I love it. I love it. So as I was saying, what I love about this oil is that it's not too um thick and because the shea butter already has oils i'm not gonna take a lot 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 you know i'm just gonna take a little just yeah work it through my hair and that is it i'm gonna follow this process for all my um all other sections of my hair so what i'm doing here is just plaiting my hair because i don't know what else to do with this hair so after applying the products i just um section the hair again work with the one part and just plait it i really can't wait for my hair to grow guys so that i can just plait twists because what is this <laughs> what the hell is this yo So the struggle is real is real there at the bottom so i just took some bloom band and just tied my hair at the bottom so that it can stay intact because yeah well the struggle is real honey <laughs> So you know washing your natural hair and plaiting it is an is a sport like it's an exercise like you need to mentally prepare for this because yeah it is really tiring what <laughs> let me know in the comment section if you wash your hair at home what type um hair are you are you natural hair 4c type are you relaxed and do you wash your hair at home or at the salon if you wash your hair at home how often do you wash it because hey baba the struggle is real <laughs> and i am almost done what a relief it's been 100 hours straight but who cares <laughs> i am all done so lastly i'm going to use this anti-itch mist also from masori it's a hair and scalp mist it's for an itchy scalp that is prone to dandruff and dryness it is suitable to use on both braided and unbraided hair and bra as you can see now this mist is so strong <laughs> oh it is so strong but i am done and i look pretty this is me trying to take a thumbnail picture actually <laughs> ah. we are at the end of the video please do like this video comment down below show some love don't forget to comment and subscribe see you on my next video guys bye